Hi, welcome to everyone. Today I am going to do very special program, very interesting PLC program. If if we have one push button and one output uh, like light, then normally we know if we press our push button, light will on. When we release, it will automatically release. Then if we can use push button when this press time press it will, it will continuously on then it if it is press second time our light will be off how can you like this program in data logic it's okay If I use memory concept, then I can do this program in ladder. Okay, this is my ladder program delta delta WPL software. Okay, now I am going to start. This is our input. This is normally open. Okay, this is input address X node. This is my push button. I will comment this F B push button. Okay. Now this best memory. I will this is M not. Okay. If I press push button, then it will this memory will energize, but I need to that memory continuously so I'm going to this memory sledge. Okay. Then M gone. Okay, I match. Now if I press this push button, then in press time this memory will energize. If it is released, the same address, this path continuously working, so memory will energize continuously okay this is press time what is happen if it is M not energized then my output mean my light will be on okay so this is M not then my output mm, I will die uh, this is my light okay L I G H T okay now what's happened now if i press this one this will be on okay then press time then if i press then what if i press then after push button will release okay now i'm going to get that memory release memory okay for that I have to tell ladder logic what this memory this memory mean press push button press memory then press memory then after release on release on mean release mean normally condition power on when I release it will be off so I have to get normally close input okay this is push button then what is then I have to get another memory for this one okay I'm not so I will tell it M1 okay then when I press my push button I have to get that memory continuously so i have to latch this one okay then what is this one m1 okay this is m1 then 
now this is press this is release memory then i am going to press second time second time press mean i have to get this me this memory also okay for what then only program no this is second time press okay press normally open we have to get for press button okay then push button okay now and second time press that status also also i have to get memory then i am going to that one as m2 okay and m2 what this is m0 this is m0 mean press time press release that memory then next not mean press then what m2 second time press mean press time press release memory then after press mean push button second time press memory is m2 okay now i have to latch this one also because i need to get memory continuously okay then m2 okay then m2 mean what m2 mean second time press so this is my output then what what hey what i can do then i can do th this path will break by m2 so i'll use normally normally close input m2 then what will happen if it is energized m2 memory then that path will break mean why not will off okay then after i i have to get last memory mean then second time pre press then after second time release okay then it mean m2 after release so i have to get normally close of push button then what that m3 memory okay this m3 memory then i have to latch this one also okay i will latch by m3 okay let's take this is my delta pls so okay when i simulate i have to get that simulator okay then it will display simulator then i have to click this one online mode and yes again yes okay now i have to press this one run okay now i am going to check this one what will happen click push push button then switch on so oh, sorry this is oh i understand this is m not
this must be m2 okay then other thing then after at last memory m3 then all program must be erased then only it will be continuously use this program then one one time press then release then second time press then my output will be off then again release then again when I push push button then it will be on okay let's check now sorry uh, I have to erase M3 then I have to erase this memory also by M3 okay let's check yes 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 now this one okay Now I will start. Okay, now I am going to press. Okay. What's happened? Oh, what is this M2 mean? My second what's second time resistance. But when what is second time resistance mean? First time press, then release time press, then again press mean second time press. But I this is small mistake. Then I I have take m not memory so what will happen then m not memory mean then press time press then this memory also small problem then i have to use if it is second time memory then i have to use this m1 m1 which mean press time press second time press press time press release then after press so this is I have to change M1 okay let's check now then what will happen okay uh, now I I have pressed okay. press time press time then M2 memory get energized so my uh, output will on okay now I am going to release my push button okay now continuously on my light okay now I am going to press second time my push button press sorry, uh, sorry. press mean on press uh, what happened then my output will off okay now I am going to release that one. Uh, what will happen? Then every memory is erased. Okay. Now I am going to again press. Now release. Again press. Oh. Uh, likewise, we can use memories. Mm, I think if you understand this one, if you not understand, Please comment me, then I will explain. Okay, thank you everyone. Good day. Please subscribe my channel.